Hey guys, Victor here with Global Gaming for a quick how-to video. Now, as you can see, Destiny is up on my TV. Now, you may be wondering, okay Vix, what do you got to show, up to show us this time? Well, it's that time of the week where our friendly neighborhood Shadow Manzer pops up. And, uh, wait, what the heck is this? Fallen Seeker. Oh, I popped another seed. Now, as you can see, my gear is all mismatched. Green, purple, yellow, blue top. I like the helmet. I like the helmet. This helmet does look badass, even though it has worse defense than my uh, regular helmet. That actually looks really cool. I like the look of that. That's really nice. I don't think it's DLC because it doesn't have the mark. But we're not here for that. Now, popping a jig in front of the vault. So, with Zer coming around this week, he brought with him, because of the DLC, new exotics. And a new consumable, called the Three of Coins. Now, what do you need to do with the Three of Coins? Well, this is really simple. I got, from doing this method, I got a total of five exotics in two days. I got the Soros Regime, year two. Which I can't touch yet, I'm getting the DLC later tonight. I got the fourth freaking horseman, and this thing looks freaking insane. This thing looks like a beast in Crucible. Look at that stability. The range is crap. I hope they have send it on it. Fitted stock. Hand loaded. And speed reload. Return to sender. Final round. CQB. C CQB accurized and field choke. The Thunderer can be fired at full auto, and it is arc damage. So, with on top of that, I also obtained, yesterday, the last word year two, which is going to be fun as hell because I have the last word year one and I love it. This one I had, I've already had, this one I've already had once they're sold it. Don't ever get this. I, I hate this thing. It sucks, especially since it takes up a primary slot, which is useless. And then for the armor... I got quite lucky. I'm running my hunter. I've been running my hunter for the past two days. And I got the year two Crest of Alpalupi. Which is totally tits because arc burn defense, arc armor, sidearm ammo, scout rifle ammo, increase the intellect or increase my strength. And I could infuse it to make it stronger. So, you're going to want to go to Zer. And it's seven strange coins for five of these three of coins. And you're going to go want to go to Venus. Upon arriving into the Venus checkpoint menu thing, where you can select your mission, I will show you where to go. It's actually really simple. So you're going to go click des set destination. Okay, let's, let's see where do we want to go. We want to go to Venus. And up here next to this strike is a mission called the Scourge of Winter. Hunt and kill Draxus, the house of Winter's Kell, hiding deep in the caves of the Ishtar Sink. Now, what you want to do... Now, this method has been found by other people, so I will give credit where credit is due. Shout out to Cactus HD for this method. It's a great method. It actually works. I don't know if Bungie intended it to be used this way, but it's going to be used this way. Now, you go through this mission until you find Draxus. Now, before you walk into his throne room... You pop a three of coins, get him down to about 1% health using a scout rifle mainly. I've been using the Mita and uh, blue sniper rifle. Uh, the blue sniper rifle, I do three crit damages, and then I just pop him a couple times with a scout rifle. Now, once he's down to about 1% health and you have popped that coin, make sure you have popped the coin or this will not work. Run up to him with an RPG of your choice. I'm using the uh, House of Wolves launcher, The Last Rebellion, which does void damage. 170 damage. Um, plus it has con cartridge, so even when I'm low on heavy ammo, I have a chance of gaining some, which is a really nice bonus. And what you want to do is you want to run up to him, shoot down at the ground right next to him, and kill yourself and him at the same time. Now, if you're lucky, and the odds are in your favor, he will drop an exotic engram of a random, random set. It could be a head engram, arms, chest, legs, primary, secondary, or petty. Mine have mainly been a chest, a primary, and a secondary. Um, but it's all random. This is a great way to fill up your collection of exotics if you don't have it. So if you've been hoarding strange coins for a long time, go do this because it's a great way to fill up those blueprints in the Vanguard's Hall and the Hall of Guardians. Anyway, guys, I'm Vix with Lobo Gaming. Go check out Cactus HD for more des daily Destiny videos. I love this game so much. Now, because I can just farm exotics all day. But, 
At any rate, you guys, I'm back off to Mars to go hunt down some strange coins to keep doing this and get the fucking Hawk Moon. I'm excited. I want the Monte Carlo. I want the Hawk Moon. I've already got the fourth Horseman PS4, PS3 exclusive. I'm excited to use it. And as soon as by, by the time the weekend's over, I'll be rank 40 and I will be running around in Crucible with that fourth horseman, making everybody hate me. At any rate, guys, please do what you do best. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, let me know what you guys want to see more in the content down below. And as always, stay cool, and I will see you in the next video. Peace out. Bye-bye.